is the Apollo uh, uh, Air Force Junior ROTC, and we're picking up uh, trash. Coatesville, Delaware Road. Uh, we're actually uh, just uh, 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 bordering the Audubon Expressway, and it's going to be just about uh, six miles worth of road we're cleaning up today. We have 21 uh, Air Force Junior ROTC cadets and three adults. We do this uh, for several reasons. Uh, one is obviously because uh, we make so many uh, dollars per mile cleaning up the, uh, the roads. But more importantly, it gives our cadets a chance to build leadership. Uh, we have a cadet that's in charge of the whole uh, detail, and then we have other leaders for each of the little groups uh, that they're responsible for. Uh, so that allows them opportunity to show leadership and, and also this is community service. So um, we also, uh, as part of our program, that's one of the main things we do, we provide community service. We're just picking up trash on the highway and uh, cleaning up a little bit. Right here, uh, this is I think Curdsville, Delaware Road, right off of Ottoman mm -hmm. Parkway. Are you surprised at what you're finding? Yeah. Oh yeah. There's a it's, lot. Of, there's a lot more trash out here than we I thought there would be. I didn't think people traveled this road this much. <laughs> what, what kind of trash are you finding? Beer cans. Yeah. Beer cans, beer bottles. A lot McDonald's. of McDonald's. Yeah, beer McDonald's. cans. Please do not throw your Please trash out your window. Yeah, that's, that's just not good for the environment, you know. What are you guys finding over here? Uh, a lot of beer cans, cigarette containers, dip containers. Almost anything. Lots of empty alcohol bottles and cans. I go down this road a lot to get to my grandma's house, and I didn't think there was this much trash out here. Hold your trash until you can get to the landfill or uh, recycling area if there's cans. Or just throw it away at home. Don't be checking it out here. There's wildlife out here that rely on this area, and if it's covered in trash and they have no home. As a community, we would appreciate it if people did not litter, especially uh, by throwing glass. There's a lot of glass seems to be uh, on the sides of the road out in this area. Uh, it's, it's hazardous not only to the environment, uh, but to the people that are trying to pick things up. The Trash for Cash program is a partnership between the state government and the county fiscal court and our solid waste department. It's funded uh, partly by the $1.75 fee that all trash deposited in our landfill has to pay. So that money is returned back to us uh, in many forms, uh, and one of them is a litter abatement program. And this program is really a win-win for everyone involved. Uh, for an organization, it not only provides you the ability to raise some money, uh, but it also provides you to have an impact on the community by helping clean our environment. To apply for the Trash for Cash program, uh, you need to be watching our website, Facebook page, and look in October and November as that is when we do open applications for the next calendar year.